Hello Falcons fans, my name is Andy Zilch, the voice of the Falcons, and I am here with the center plate executive chef Alan Judkins, our fine foods that get prepared for you game after game here is all due to this guy right here. And we're going to have a little cook-off between three of our Falcons players. And first of all, Chef, what are we going to be cooking tonight with our players? We're going to be doing a Mexican grilled chicken topped with a watermelon black bean corn salsa and pickled onions. And that's served on a bed of baby spinach and radicchio. Okay. And those players are going to learn how to cook it. They're going to try and duplicate it. And we'll see who wins. we got Sean Collins, Corey Kellick, and Michael Chaput. Gentlemen, ready? Get it. We're at station number one. Sean Collins is in the lead. How do you feel so far? Do you feel confident? I feel pretty confident. We'll see how it goes. Uh, you know, I got to cut the watermelon, got to cut the onion, so we got some uh, some complicated stuff ahead. This is the most challenging part. It looks like cutting the onion. Yeah, it's a challenge. I hope my eyes don't water. That's the biggest thing. All right, we got uh, Corey Kowak here at Station 2. I heard you kind of uh, got a little jab to Michael Chaput using all the vinegar earlier. Yeah, it's first come, first serve here, so uh, he was a little bit behind. So anything to get yourself the edge, you know? How do you feel about everything so far? Do you feel like everything's looking good? Um, <laughs> short term memory's a little off. <laughs> Struggling here to remember some things, but uh, so far, so good. All right, we're here with Chef Allen. Which one of the three do you think has followed the directions most appropriately? Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> I'm going to throw him. Well, come on, we got to throw somebody under well, the bus here. You know, <laughs> he's got a knife, so I'm going to be <laughs> kind of quiet here. It's, there are varying degrees of following directions, I think. I think down on the end, uh, nice, I can see nice small cuts. He's a little ahead of the game beyond the others. But yeah, here, it's all right, it's okay, it's okay. But his red onions here are cut really nice. Um, everybody has their, their brine on the stove for their pickles ready, so that's good. Everybody's chicken is um, marinating in some um, amazing concoctions that, that will um, have varying degrees of heat, shall we say. Okay. <laughs> all right. And over here, he's, he's catching up. <laughs> it's Sean Collins, everybody. He's just a little bit behind. <laughs> All right, we're here at Station 3 with Michael Shapu. Chef Allen actually just complimented your chopping. Are you, are you really good in the kitchen, in general, generally? Eh, not bad. You know, right now I'm looking pretty good. I think uh, Chef Allen gave us some good uh, tips, so I think right now I'm doing pretty well. What's your go-to when you cook at home? Uh, mostly chicken. Uh, in the summer times, I'll do a lot of grill. But other than that, I'm not too, uh, I don't dabble too much. <laughs> Heat is on. It's because the grill is on. The chicken's on. That means the competition is on. All right, out of the three plates, which one do you think looks the best? Appearance-wise, you know, appearance-wise, the onions down on that end are beautiful. They're mounded up, they're not lying flat. The fan job in this middle one is really nice. And the, the fleur-de-lis of the radicchio on this side is just accents the plate, and I think it's beautiful. And we'll see which one of the three actually tastes the best. And now let's meet our judges. From the Greater Springfield Convention and Visitors Bureau, President Mary Kay Wadra. From the American Hockey League, Coordinator of Digital Media and Communications, Kenzie Janke. And from Rock 102, Producer Steve Nagel. It's a little too spicy, a little too hot. Okay. What would you guys' thoughts on the presentation at this point? Nothing. I 
Again, with Chef Judkins here, we appreciate our support with our judges as well as our players and our great staff at Center Plate. Again, February 21st is when this dish will be prepared by professional chefs for our fans here at the Mass Mutual Center. Thank you. All right, we're here with the winner, Corey Cowick. What did you do better than the other two guys? Um, I really don't know what it was I did better. Uh, I was actually a little bit scared uh, due to maybe some over, over garlicky tones to my plate, but uh, I, don't know, I just tried to follow the instructions as good as, uh, as, good as possible, and uh, I was pretty lucky, I think. Everybody liked the organization of your plate, too. What, what was the theme behind it? What did you do right? Um, well, I took the uh, kind of, it's not a cabbage, I forget the name of it, but like the, the main part from the, the middle, so it's kind of like a more of a structured uh, to it than, than the end, where it's kind of flopping around, like uh, Collie had on his there, but uh, I, I made sure the fan was really good. Uh, the, one of the things he said when he was uh, kind of talking about the plate was fanning the chicken, and that's the focal point of the plate, obviously, so I wanted the chicken to look good, and uh, hopefully it would taste good too. Regular chef, Corey Cowick. Fans, thanks for watching.